On the evening of the season 2 finale, FX has announced a third season renewal of its docu-series Welcome to Wrexham, which takes fans of football and newcomers alike. Behind the scenes of the Welsh soccer club owned by actors Rob McElhenney and Ryan Reynolds. While it still seems like it's a bit too much like a real-life Ted Lasso, the boys have won over the hearts and minds of the small Welsh mining town and the journey they've taken the team on since the takeover has been nothing short of miraculous. The third season will debut in spring 2024. The Emmy-nominated series followed the acting duo as they purchased Wrexham, a non-league club playing in the English football system, with the goal of turning them into big fish in the football world. The first season ended in disappointment with the team just failing to secure promotion to the English Professional Football League system and the money that comes with it. The season two finale will focus on whether or not the Red Dragons finally take that step toward the promised land. The wild global success of Welcome to Wrexham is a testament to the courage and vision of Rob and Ryan, the dogged spirit of the Red Dragons, and the hope and devotion of the people of Wrexham, said Nick Grad, President, FX Entertainment. It's a story that has only begun to be told and one that everyone can continue to follow along with in the third season. Our thanks to the creative team who captured these thrilling moments and everyone who achieved what seemed impossible only a short time ago. How well is the Wrexham Club doing now? Naturally, spoilers might follow for the season two finale here, but they're doing well. Very well. In fact, a stunning conclusion to last season saw both Wrexham and Notts County go head-to-head -head with a dramatic match that saw Wrexham win in the last moments to pip their rivals to first place, going on to win the National League and gaining promotion. After 17 matches, just over a third of the way through the English League 2 season, Wrexham sits on 33 points and in second place, good enough for promotion to League 1, the third tier of the English system. They've also garnered a reputation as the great entertainers of the league, with 61 goals scored and conceded in those 17 matches, an average of almost four per game. Here's hoping the conclusion to Season 3 brings just as much excitement. Stay tuned to Collider for updates.